Same setup as the last one, guys. So, front feet on hips guard, push the foot leg back, a la heva, drops the combat base, foot goes in the hip, and move my hips back, I get shin to shin. Okay. Sit up. Okay, control his leg so he can't take his shin away. I get my grip, cause him to put his arm in the mat. Swing the deep half. Get my power grip. So, again. I want to make sure that when I try to open up his lapel, I don't leave space so he's going to hook him, then I'm in trouble. Okay. So I want to make sure that I'm constantly keeping this tucked to my body. So from here, I open it up, I bring my hand across, and I want to pull this and take the slack out of the gi, so I'm controlling this far hip. Okay. At a beginner's level, I would think about either grabbing here, keeping this tucked, or hiding my hand under here. Okay, so from here, Detail on keeping Carl's foot off the mat. Okay. I'm going to swing his leg this way as my right leg comes over the back of his thigh and I bring my head up. Okay. So the first detail is, guys, I'm coming up on my elbow. Okay. But this time, Carl's left hand is going to grab my knee here. So I can't bring this knee out to do the last transition. Okay. So from here, I keep my grip here on his knee. I try to put my right knee to the mat this way. Okay. And I want to keep my hook in here. I want to make sure this hook stays in. So from here, I'm going to roll over, making sure my hook's in. Okay. And we're in the truck. Okay. For this variation here, we'll just um, go to the back. So I put my foot on my heel. I kick his hips forward, my hand, I've had the gi, switches, second hook comes in, now in the back, just again. Feet on hips, Dalla Heva, drop the combat base, get shin to shin, lapel, all the stuff we've done before. I get my gi grip. Okay, I come out the back door. Carl grabs my knee. Okay, so I can't bring it out to the last move. Okay, so from here, I try to get my right knee to the mat, but I want to make sure that when I do this, that my right hook stays in place. From here, I'm going to roll. Okay, options from the truck, I can get the calf crank, okay, or just take the back. Um, when we done the back game, guys, um, the drill was I can, Carl can retake my position by grabbing the pants, and now he has me, he's got me in the truck, okay. So, let's go back to where we were. From here, okay. Keeping it real simple, where I have control of his hip, my heel is on, uh, my left foot is on my heel. I want to expose his back by kicking my legs to the mat. Now his back's off the mat, I'm going to try and occupy that space. So my left hand's coming underneath, my right hand's coming over the shoulder, kick out, now I'm in the back position. Again, one more time. I'm going to force him to put his hands in the mat. I'm going to kick him all the way forward. Okay. I'll grab my knee. Okay, so I need another option or another path to get to the, to the, the back because I can't pull this one out. This is the first move. So when I try, I try to get my right knee to the mat, I've got to keep make sure that my right hook's in place here. I keep my grip. I'm just going to roll all the way over. Okay. Push my foot to the mat here, which exposes his back. My left hand's going to capture the shoulder. My right hand's coming underneath. Okay. So put my hook in. I'm now in the back position. OK. 
Okay, so that's your shin to shin sweep, guys, with a rolling back attack. Let's try for five.